So I thank Rotary, I thank you for after 10 years of being part of this, and for each and every one of you, for whatever part you pray, play, even if it was a prayer for us, even if it was a good thoughts for us, even if you were on the board of directors for how many years, I thank you so much. And now, would you like to put on your teenage hat? Say yeah. yes. Say yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. Oh, come on, a little more. Okay, teenage hands. Let's go with hats. Okay, we're gonna put your hands up and go. There's your teenage hat. And I have some people that are going to come up here and support me because I'm going to teach you a tool that we teach at Winners Camp. And we promise you this tool will help you in all areas of your life. Even if it's with your employers, your employees, with your CEOs, with whomever, this tool will help you. And thousands and thousands of teenagers have used it in school, college, and university, and it works. So would you put your hands together in a huge way for the winners, Camp Ohana, to share the stage. We went, we, we went unplugged because at Winners Camp we don't have iPods, iPhones, anything. We go unplugged so that people really do communicate in a different way. And so, this piece is called, okay, this piece is called Slant. It's called what is called Slant. It's called what is called Slant. It's called what is called Slant. What you see us do, you do, okay? Because that's what you're doing, you're being teenagers. Okay? All right, okay, so I'm going to teach you a tool called slant. What is it called? It's called slant. What is it called? It's called slant. Okay, and uh, it's an acronym S L A N T slant. Big S stands for straight. How do we say straight? Ka chunk. How's that? Where's my S man? There you are. <laughs> okay, why do we sit straight? Well, more oxygen to your lungs and into your brain, and you can think better because you're sitting up, you're not slouching, you're not in a slouching physiology, and you look better. Most people are slouching. Don't they look great? Don't they look like somebody you'd want to hire? Don't you think they look like somebody that you'd like to admit into your school? They look successful. Here's another reason, just an aside, watch this. Ten pounds. <laughs> when you stand up straight and you sit straight, you look better and you feel better. Big F stands to sit straight. How do you sit straight? Control. Participation is the key. You guys do what they do, okay? Okay, because that's your teenage role, okay? One, two, three. Big F stands to sit straight. How do you sit straight? Control. Yes, you did. <laughs> Big L stands to lean forward. How do we lean forward? Whoa. Whoa! Now, if you go back into your workspace or anything and you start going, whoa, 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 people are going to think you're nuts, right? Or that you went to a rotary meeting that was being led by us. But it's just to use your physiology to lean into someone's conversation. Big L stands for lean forward, how we lean forward. Whoa! Big A stands for ask questions, how do we ask questions? Me, 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 me. questions and you get the answers. Ask questions and you get the answers. <laughs> okay, that's the bottom line. Is ask the questions, you get the answer. And the teacher is not the enemy. Your teacher is not the enemy. They are not the enemy. They are, this is for your being a teenager, remember? Your teacher, out of all the people other than your own family, are the ones that care about you the most. So big up, sister, straight, how are you sister, straight? Participation is the key. Okay, big ass stands to sit straight. How do we sit straight? Cut. Big ass stands to lean forward. How do we lean forward? Whoa. Big A stands for ask questions. How do we ask questions? Me, 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 me. Big M stands to nod. How do we nod? Oh yeah. How do we nod? Oh yeah. Again, physiology. If you're leaning into someone and you're really paying attention to them, think about how sometimes you're with your spouse or something, you're like this, leaning away from them. What if you just gently leaned into them? Wouldn't they feel better? Wouldn't they feel like you were really listening to them? Big L stands to sit straight. How do we sit straight? Big L stands to lean forward. How do we lean forward? Whoa! Big L stands to ask questions. How do we ask questions? Me, 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 me. Big L stands to nod. 
How do we know it? Oh, yeah. And big T for the T zone. And talk to the teacher. Talk, 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 talk. Here's the future pace at Winston Camp. When you go to university, when you go to college, you will sometimes be in an auditorium with another 259 other people. And you want to make sure that you introduce yourself to the teacher, that you let them know who you are, and that you talk to them. And then you also sit in the T zone. You sit in the T zone. And the T-Zone is, well, first and foremost, now with online classes and everything, just show up. <laughs> just show up. Your parents spend a lot of money for you to go to this school, or your grandparents, or your aunties, or uncles, so just show up. So that was slant. What was it? It was called slant. Everybody sit up. Practice slant. How do you feel? Good. <laughs> OK, put your hands together. Here's way for our slant. Cheerleaders! Your favorite affirmation and what it means to you. Focus, follow one course until successful. If for the sake in if for the sake of efficiency we move in disharmony, then efficiency costs too much. And it means to me that you need to Make things right before you move on. My favorite affirmation is success leaves clues. In the meaning that when somebody else succeeds, you can follow that example. Mine is imagination is just as important as knowledge. Because if you have all the knowledge and no way to imagine something greater, what can you use it for? My affirmation is change. Change happens and new growth emerges. Change is important because if you're doing something and it's not necessarily working out for you, change a little bit. You never know what might work. My favorite is Yoko Whippy. You only get out what you put in. Which basically means you should go into something with a positive attitude because when you do, you're going to get so much out of that experience. My affirmation is CLEAR, which stands for Clear, Last Event and Reform Focus. And this tool has given me the power to, if something goes wrong or somebody does something, to just clear it and move on without dragging it with me. Mine's is fear, false evidence appearing real because fear is a false something that you get afraid of that's fake. <laughs> Mine is be bitter or be better because there's things in our life that will happen that will hold us back because we spend all our energy focused on that bad thing. But if you, like Joseph, just clear and you move on, you'll see that you're a lot more positive and you have more drive to do things. Thank you, and that's strong. I think great. Well, thank you for having us. Thank you for all the support that you give us. And um, just practice slant and have a, have fun. I love you all. I appreciate every each and every one of you. Mahalo, malama kono. Uh, I finished my time too. <laughs>